the heck, Kenny? What the heck? Hello, guys. Welcome back to some more The Walking Dead. So, so how how thing how things over here? Hey there, girls. So, um, you two actually look relaxed. You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, um, uh, how's that? It's easy. Well, yeah. So, you're good? Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people well, eating don't each ignore other me. for the past three days. It's peaceful here, no? He's a first grader, all right, and how was the city? How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some. Just, just... Uh, it's okay. It's it doesn't fun. matter. You had to do what you, you had to do, man. Anymore. I want to go home tomorrow, but even then I can't take away the things we... The things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Oh, heck no. Things were bad before. Bad now, but they're different, you see? People are eating each other. But they weren't before. The banks, the politics, the, the crap. What? Those things are gone. Hell comes in a lot of different colors. The heck? <laughs> That's not what I wanted to do at all. So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale, like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It yeah, that, that's like not going to happen. Uh, used no, to. I used to. I was let go a little while back. Well, that's too bad. Well, I hear people always clamor back to college after a big disaster. People don't want to die ignorant, I guess. Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Alright, you guys have fun now. Don't eat each other while I'm not there. <laughs> oh, lovely. Alright, what up? It's not the most reliable pickup in the world, but it gets the job done. So how's it going with hey you, there, Kenny? Uh, Kenny? Need any help? Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? Well, I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? Heck no. I have no I idea. I have no idea what I'm doing. At least you're honest. Shit. Better than I was when Duck showed up. You'll figure it out. Well, what's your plan? So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've well, got that sounds boat. lovely. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. How's your son doing? How's your son doing? Good, I think. Kachi's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. See you. You're sure about that? Oh, they're having a good time over there. It's gonna take everything over here first, then. Alright, so we have that. So that is what they're reinforcing, I'm guessing. Anything inside the barn I didn't look at? No, nothing? Okay. I still have the radio. Oh, the little thingy. Well, hello there! You know how to drive it? Sure don't. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bill, though. I'm good. How are you doing, Doug? You, you didn't even say, okay. How are you doing, Doug? Good! I'm gonna drive the tractor! I'm the foreman! Lift with your back, Sean! Uh, okay. 
Interesting. Sean's still working on that fence. Hey, Lee. What's up? Need a hand? Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. All right. Doing the, the work. My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. You gotta do what you gotta you do. You gotta do what you can to survive. Like put a gun to that kid's head and pull the trigger? Fuck that, man. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. If the kid is you don't a zombie. See things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. Uh... Sometimes it's kill or be killed. I guess. Don't yeah, that's too good after that. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? I'm not quite sure where my ex-wife is. Ah. Oh. Yeah. For sure. Yeah, that, that, that's what it is. That's what, uh, that's what's probably up, all you know? need cut for now. Thanks. Aha, I help. And Sean, thanks again for the ride. No problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. Oh, sure, he's right over there. Okay. All right, see you guys later. I'm, I'm going to help in the barn. But hello there, Herschel. How'd you get out of Atlanta? Got a ride? I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked until your boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Uh, huh? This farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. <laughs> Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's hmm. your family now? Parents, I don't know about wife, that. Girlfriend? I actually disagree. Family isn't all that matters. My parents are in Macon. My parents are in Macon with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Looking for help in her house? Yeah. I was looking for help in her house. Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? Sure. Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're going to have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're going to make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're going to be in trouble. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. What the heck? Go! I'll get my gun! The heck are they start why are you starting the goddamn tractor? Freaking, sorry, the kid is useless. Goddamn thing. No. Ah! 
Oh, he was so nice too. I'm okay, Pop. I'm okay. I can fix you, don't worry. We'll stitch you up. It, it almost... It almost got me, man. It, Lee tried to save me. I know, son. I... Oh. Crap. But there's one nice guy less in the world. Piece of shit, let him die. It's nobody's you fault. You can't blame Kenny. The hell I can't. You watch your back. We can tell it's your daughter and you need his help. Please. Just go. Get out and never come back. Can someone turn off that tractor Got before more come? Or are you just gonna kinda leave it on? Anyone? And any time now? Thank you. And how the heck did I not spot them? Well, this is as far as we're going. And it's far enough. Look! Hey there! You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Yeah, that's totally a person that's eating another person. Fuck! We're trapped! Run! Yeah, just freaking run, guys. She has a gun, we need her. <laughs> Take risks like this. And we can't just let people die either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. It could be dangerous. Just a point. Worse, they couldn't let them right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? We okay. Not dangerous. Just regular folks. What's dangerous is a bunch of people running outside and drawing their attention to us. Lee's right. We're just regular folks, but we actually like helping people. You'll have to excuse, uh, me, uh, excuse me, Kenny. <laughs> anyone will. This is about survival. Do you guys not see what's happening? I, I get you. I get you. I understand, actually. I see where you're coming from. I, I understand. I, I have to pee. I'd go out there again in a second. Like uh, in a minute. Would. In a minute, Clem. They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join them then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and She's not wrong. just ran out there. She's not wrong. They took a risk. Yes, we did. And we appreciate it. Now let's settle down. Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. No, he's not. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. He's Over not freaking bitten. We'll dig one hole. No, 
I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny, stop him! Hey, what do we do about this guy? Dad, it's just a boy. It, it's... Lily, I'll handle this. But your heart, Dad. You, you need to calm Need down. to stop. We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. Everyone, chill the fuck out! Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here. And none of this will fucking matter. I don't like this guy. He's right a dick. Now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten! That's how you turn! But he's, he's not, not bitten. bitten. Please stop how this. stupid do you stop have to be? Him. Ooh, I'm upsetting him. Upsetting is getting eaten alive. What if this was your daughter? Never would have happened. She's not some snot-nosed toddler, okay? She's United States Air Force. Fuck you and her. I'm gonna kill him, Cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee! Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Keys behind the counter. Probably. Hey, Probably. I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. Then let's wait until she and will. If she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, once she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. Deal with it. Then we deal with it then. But right now, we're just freaking everybody out. And get ready to deal with it because that boy is bitten. It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now. No! You don't touch that boy! You don't touch anybody! I've got a little girl I'm trying to protect in here, too. You wanna get violent, you old fuck? Well, come on! You better have a plan to kill me, though, because it's me before anyone else in here! <coughs> Jesus! <coughs> oh, that's my... I don't see anything. Get away from her, you son of a bitch! What is everyone else doing? Help, what are they doing? Man. Who took that shot? Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thank you. You okay? Just great, thanks. Helping someone. Dad! That was helping someone. I hope he died from a heart attack. I did try to get him to calm down. Can it, asshole? It's his heart. My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. You really want us to do that, huh? We'll get in there somehow. Thank you so much. What? We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. Then I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. Who are you and, and I don't know your personality. You know your way around? Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? 
It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. All right, nice. Get into pills. Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. It's not damaged. Glad this place didn't get looted. I hope I'm not on a timer here. I kind of hope he dies though, so it's fine. What what is he doing? <laughs> okay. Oh crap, it's I did not, not mean much, to do that. But here. You sure? Yeah. You're under quite a bit of stress. Thanks. Crap, I did not mean to do that. Sweet. Don't mention it. Well, I guess you got some food How's now. How's doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Oh yeah, I get that. Now his heart's acting up again and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad, that didn't help. Well, it's freaking his own fault. What do you think about all this? What is there to think? The dead are up, walking around, eating people, and turning them into more... more of them. I mean, Jesus. We need to stick together and get through this. What's wrong with him? He's got a heart condition. He takes nitroglycerin tablets pretty regularly. I've seen a few bad attacks that he couldn't get over and needed to go to the hospital. Yeah, that's uh, not really an option right now. I'm just trying to keep him relaxed. And what are we gonna do when, um... When we don't have anywhere we can get those pills? You're from here? I work at Warner Robins, the Air Force Base. Yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UTA. Was anyone here when you guys got here? No, this place was pretty wrecked. We pulled a couple of bodies out of the office. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Did you know anybody here? Yeah, the owners, they were, uh, we were close. With the way your parents went We thing. found an older couple in the office. Dad hauled them out in case they weren't really dead. So you got no one, huh? He's got a temper. Ah, fuck you. Yeah, he doesn't mean it. It's just that... Yeah? We've got kids here, We've families. Got kids here. Families. He and I are a family. I'm just saying some people can't handle a temper like that. Hell, barely seems like you can. It's just his way. Don't make him the reason everything's screwed. I'm not saying it's the reason, I'm just saying... Where's her mom? Think about the other people. Savannah, I think. Oh, you guys aren't together. Oh, uh, no, I'm not her dad. I found in a house when getting out of Atlanta. She'd been surviving by herself. I think the girl's parents didn't make it. Oh. I heard an answering message. They were in Savannah. She was home with a sitter. It wasn't good. Well... She's lucky to have you. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. Sounds like she relates to that guy. Oh, another one. Let's give this to Clementine. Clementine, I got some candy for you. It's not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. Hey there. Hi. Any word from Glenn? Any word from Glenn? Nothing. Is he okay? Yeah, I think so. You're doing a good job. Can I get you Can anything? I, uh, get you anything? I'm okay. Maybe I'm a little hungry. Still, huh? Yeah, it wasn't much. I know, Glenn. I'll see if I can find something else for you. 
We should get to know each other. So, um... Are you okay? What? Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I just, uh... I'm good. That's good. Indeed it's yeah, good. I, I think so. Uh, being good is... Oh, that's good. awful. This is Despite so awkward. The circumstances. Yep. We'll sit tight. Okay. Yeah, the, the... Okay. Alright, all cool. Being good that things are good, you know? You're a pretty good shot. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. A reporter, eh? What are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work, though. Here, let me have a look. Hmm, nothing. How can I turn it around? Behind, eh? There are no batteries in this thing. What now? You know that there are no batteries in that thing. Yeah, of course. I, I mean, yeah. No. I can try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. Why does she look so sketchy? Wait, Cle Oh, Glenn! I know that character from The Walking Dead. No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead guards. Oh, that's sad. We can't let anything happen to Ducky. I know, hon. Those are batteries, right? I got the batteries. What's up? Hey, Lee. You really gave that old man hell. Yeah. We got pushed, you know? You don't have to tell me. I was ready to tear the man's head off. Anyway, we, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. What's, What's the plan? plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? They, uh, own this place. They, uh, pulled some bodies out of the office before we got here. They're, uh, Gone. Oh, sweetie. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but yeah, they did. So sad. How's Duck doing? How's Duck doing? He's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. No kidding. How's she doing? She's good, I think. She's good, I think. She's a tough one right there. She's just a little girl, Ken. What are you saying, Lee? She spent days surviving on her own? That's right. Not just any little girl can do that. Hi, guys, hey, all right? Guys all right? Oh, we're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? We've all been through a lot. Lee, you got a second? Sure. Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. I panicked, you know. I'm not proud of it. All right, it, had, it, it happens. I guess, but I can't stop seeing him in my head. Yeah, that's rough. I killed that boy. We could have saved him together. You didn't have a choice. You think you do when you look back on it. Well, he did but have a choice. He could have put down the kid and let the kid run for himself, or like at least you put him somewhere else. Choice. I guess. But but he could have done something. Let it go. I just don't tell him I actually wanted to save the other guy instead of his kid. <laughs> Sorry, we only need one kid. They're, they're a very big drag on us, okay? We, we can't have too many kids here now. Otherwise, we won't be able to do anything. The we have to keep the kids there. all the time. It's just, um... It's just survival, you know? Alright, but that's also gonna be for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, click that like button. If you want to see more from me, search for 8,000. Click the subscribe button. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. And as always, stay awesome.